are kicking off the best of 2020 series on my channel and we're starting it all with the best skincare of 2020. Hello my friends, I feel like 2020 was a disaster in so many ways, but for me, my skin kind of did a 180. I'm going to be showing you 10 products that I discovered this year that I feel are really, really good and I feel have affected my skin so well. And I'm going to be showing you three devices also that I feel like in conjunction with the skincare have really helped my skin turn a corner this year. and despite menopause because I have had the menopause hot flashes from you know where and the skin changes and all of those things. So I wanted to share these with you. It's really great skincare. Also, if you're new to my channel, I wanna say a special welcome to you. Thanks so much for being here and I hope that you do decide to subscribe. Don't forget to hit the little bell icon because that is how you are notified I think YouTube has finally got that all figured out. So some channels were not getting notified, mine being one of them, but hopefully YouTube does have that figured out by now. And also if everybody that is here wouldn't mind just giving me a quick thumbs up, it does help my channel. And for all of you that have been here with me for a while, thank you so much for all of your fantastic support of my channel and my videos. Appreciate you more than you know. All right, we're just gonna start with what we do and then go through it as far as the steps. The first step I do at nighttime is take off all of my makeup and I do that with this Hada Labo cleansing oil. I discovered this this year and I really love it. It does take everything and it completely breaks it down and helps you to take it off. And for me, this is a great one. I love cleansing balms as well. The Good Molecules Cleansing Balm is one of my very favorites, but I've been using this since I ran out of that and I really do like it. They do the same thing. This one, you probably get a bit more in here. It's taken me a long time to go through this. I'm about that far down, almost done, but I I will repurchase this again. It's just been one that really takes all of the makeup, even the waterproof mascara off, and I love it. Now, I will say that my secret weapon to actually getting all of the mascara off are these microfiber cloths. This is what I take my makeup off with at night, and there is nothing like this. I will link the, these below. They come in a pack of five for I think around $8 or so. So that's really good compared to the makeup eraser that everybody touts. It's the same cloth. It takes it off just as good. So I use the oil in conjunction with the um, cloths and it's just wonderful. Then I will wring these out really well, rinse it out really well with water and I'll go in with my second cleanse, which has been the Rose Water Daily Cleansing Gel from Good Molecules. Now Good Molecules came out with this this year and I love the way this makes me feel for a second cleanse. My skin doesn't feel stripped and yet it feels clean and there's a kind of a balance there when you're talking about different cleansers. You don't want to strip away so much that your skin feels tight, but you don't want to leave an oil behind because then your serums won't sink in. And I feel like this one achieves it very well. And I also use this in the morning. I kind of switch between another one that I've had for quite a while from Derma E, the glycolic, which I love, but this one is a great cleanse at night after your oil. Also, I know you guys have heard this from me so many times, but from Good Molecules is the niacinamide brightening toner. Now this one came to me, I believe the end of last year. I'm not 100% sure on that, but this has completely helped my pores do a 180. If you have large pores, you will probably see a difference in your pores after one bottle of this. I know that it was just weeks for me and I felt like my pores were so much more refined. This has niacinamide in it, licorice root, and alpha arbutin, and all of those products are products that have been known to brighten the skin. And niacinamide does a little sweeping effect with our skin as well and helps those pores flush out the sebum too, which is really good. So I use this, sometimes I will use it at night as well, but mostly this is my morning toner love this stuff. It is something that I will not be without. It is just awesome. And this is probably, 
I don't know, like my sixth bottle or so. So I repurchased this over and over again. And yeah, it did come to me approximately at the beginning of the year and it's just been an outstanding product. Also what came to me this year is from Cranicel. And this is a serum. The serum contains bifida, galactomyces, and I believe a little bit of niacinamide as well. It is a pretty good size bottle. I think it's about one and seven ounces. One, yes, 1.7 ounces on it. And what I love about it is I was using the Secret Key Galactomyces and the Isen Tree Bifida formula, which there's nothing wrong with using those separate because you get huge doses of each of those ingredients separately. And both of those ingredients are a fermentation process. So they really have the effect of being able to brighten and make the skin smooth and just really help turn back the clock as far as what I've noticed so far. And I really love that this serum has both of those in so I don't have to have two different products. I have both of them in here. Now the Bifida in here I think is around 60% and the Galactomyces this is around 30, maybe a little bit more on both of those. I use this in the morning and evening. And the reason that it's so good is the people that were making beer, those fermentation processes, they noticed that their hands were looking bright and pretty and that they didn't have wrinkles on them and that they, and by the way, isn't that cute right there? Okay, I have a story to tell you that I told in the other video as well. I've got a cut here, I've got one on my finger and then what this is. So you know I have a puppy now and his name is Ollie. And he um, was eating a bone the other night and he'd had this bone, I don't know, four or five other times. So I didn't think anything of it, but he ate it into, it was just kind of a tube and he tried to swallow that and it was like this long and he's a puppy. And so he, he swallowed it, but then he was like crying because it was like stuck and there was no way it was going down. It had to come out. So I stuck my fingers down there and I had to try and grab it. And in the process, he thought he was being attacked or I wasn't being nice or something. And he just bit down on me. And yeah, I got... <laughs> A mother's love is what I got. I just, I knew that I had to get that out of him and I did. I pulled it out and the bone was all bloody and I'm like, oh no, he's got blood down his windpipe. And then my son looked at me and said, mom, that's your hand. And I hadn't even noticed anything. I knew he was biting. I knew it hurt, but I hadn't even noticed because I was so worried about him. So yeah, these are my war wounds from extracting a bone from a dachshund. So <laughs> One of those things. All right, let's move on with my next product, which is from Imagine Dermatology. And this is the Hyaluronic Hydration Honey. This is a supercharged moisturizer. If anybody has been following me for any length of time, you know that I have uber dry skin. And especially in the winter, when we turn on that um, forced air heat that dries everything out, and then where I live is a desert, pretty much, the humidity even doesn't get up much past 8% normally. So you turn that on, you get those cold winds blowing, all of those things contribute to my skin looking like leather and being so dry and feeling like it's gonna crack. But these kinds of products are what I use in order for my skin to look supple and nice. And this product, not only does it have hyaluronic acid in it, but it also has polyglutamic acid in it. Now that has four times the amount, four times the ability of hyaluronic acid to hold water. We know that hyaluronic acid holds a thousand times its weight in molecular water, but polyglutamic acid, is four times that, 4,000 times its weight in water. So you definitely wanna spritz your face before you use something like this. But it also has urea, it has uh, trehalose, and it has lactic acid, all of which have been known to soften the skin and give that really jolt of moisture. And then it also has dermal amino acid complex in it. It's just a really good serum. I don't know that you would need many more serums if you were just somebody looking for that boom of hydration into your skin. It's just awesome. And I have loved this. It does the job. Make sure you use, like I said, maybe spritz your face with some water before, splash it with some water, use this, and then go on to whatever serum, whatever other serums you like, or if you wanna just put a moisturizer on top of this, 
fabulous absolutely fabulous i also want to share with you from simply beautiful this is a micro polish this one was sent to me and as you can see i haven't used very much and that's because this stuff goes a very long way this is micro fine beads set into a clay like product so when i use this i use it right after i have used my cleanser and then i go in and i just polish my skin a bit with this now you can use a chemical exfoliant, lots of people like that. I do that about once a week with the Ordinary's AHA BHA peel, that red stuff that looks like beet juice. But this one right here, I just use on mornings that I feel like my skin doesn't need that deep um, exfoliating, that deep overturn. It's just needing a little bit of a buff to make it look a little bit brighter. Lots of people don't like having a physical exfoliant. They feel like it kind of tears their skin up. So be careful if you do have sensitive skin. I want you to be mindful of that. It's that the micro fine beads. They're very, very fine. So I don't feel like it irritates my skin. And some days my skin can be very angry at me because of my retin-A. But this one right here just seems to take off all that dead skin and, and just helps to be able to quickly go and polish my skin and make it look brighter and i've been loving that one as well also another one that i am very very impressed with this product this is from niod and this is the neck elasticity catalyst now i am not one that normally goes for any sort of neck cream but i thought i would try this because it just looked different than all of the neck creams i've seen the ones that i've tried you get them on and yeah they feel okay as they're going on but there is a product in there something that they use to make you feel like you're getting a tightening effect that will eventually just sit on the skin and as you are putting on your makeup or as you're um, maybe putting on your sunscreen or something it balls off and that drives me crazy when some product gets on my skin it's not sinking in and it's balling up and making you know a mess of my makeup that i've just spent 20 30 minutes doing but this doesn't you can tell that this is a very thick product i'm not crazy about the delivery system however they say that the double size of this comes in a different delivery system but this is a very thick product that looks like the consistency of honey um, it doesn't come out very easily at all. <laughs> you have to uh, really kind of almost dig in there. I store mine upside down so I don't have to and I can just touch the top. But as I'm putting this on my hand, it feels silky. It feels lovely. It doesn't have a great scent. It smells like it's definitely got ingredients in there that should be helping. And I feel like this just penetrates the skin goes so seamlessly into the skin and just makes my neck so soft. My neck and my decollete, and then I go about halfway up my cheeks for this situation right here with my skin. I know that my skin is very saggy after I lost that 100 plus pounds. It was just hanging and just felt awful, and I started using this along with a device that I'm gonna show you in just a second, but I was using the device, the LED light is what I'm gonna show you. But I was using that and I didn't feel like I was having the effects that this does, especially for the smoothness and how silky my skin feels now. And I just can't say enough about how well this sinks into your skin. I know that this is not inexpensive, but I did get mine from Skin Store. So if you're interested, they do have sales all the time. Get on their mailing list and you can get quite a bit off. So I do love that one. Now, in talking about this LED light, I actually have two. And the reason I have two is because I talked about this one that is cordless on my channel and you can't get this one anymore. I've looked and looked for it and you can't find it anymore. So I wanted to try another one that I could show you guys. And this is my red light therapy. It does come with different heads and they just pop out and then you can pop them back on and the green one i am excited to try i haven't had enough i haven't had 
enough time to test that one out but they say that it helps with dark circles you guys know i complain about my dark circles all the time so i'm excited to be able to try that one for dark circles but this is for the this is red i love this one as much as i love the other one because you can really just put it where you want to you get that targeted led light the red is for cellular turnover to help collagen so as you're turning over those cells and as you're promoting collagen through the red light therapy your wrinkles diminish and i'll tell you the most i've noticed is right around my mouth and right at my 11s i have terrible frown lines because i've always been somebody that really spent a lot of time with a lot of facial expressions everybody knew what i was feeling and so for my lips they have terrible vertical lines i have the 11s i have bad lines across my forehead makeup is smoke and mirrors people but this is what is tried and true as far as helping those this year i have really felt like this led light and then the other device i'm going to show you has helped me so much actually there's two more devices i'm going to show you so it's just helped me so very much it's helped me to be able to feel a little bit better about aging and how quickly all of these things are coming on me especially during menopause and then i heard on penny's channel about this isn tree green toner fret green tea fresh toner and the reason that i was so excited about this is the study that penny showed is that this green tea put on your face about 15 to 20 minutes before you do your led light will boost the efficacy of the red light 10 times if i can find something that's going to boost what i'm doing 10 times you bet i'm going to jump on it and that's what this is this is just a fabulous product that has really helped me and i am telling you i do this every single night and this has really made a difference it just seems to be accelerating the process of rejuvenating those fine lines especially around my mouth my mouth has just something has happened to where i feel like everything is so much better around my mouth no more harsh harsh vertical lines i still have them somewhat but no more harshness and i'm just really loving this and i'm trying to be really really patient with my eyes because i have a lot of like i said a lot of expression lines the eyes are a little bit harder but along with the eyes i actually won in a contest on instagram this naira device so this was gifted to me but it wasn't gifted to me as an influencer and you have probably seen the naira everywhere this is five to ten minutes for me i do use it around my mouth and i use it in these marionette lines or um nasal labia folds that's what those are called marionette lines are down here but i use it in those i use it around my mouth i use it on my 11s and all around my eyes and i if i could do it i would like be doing this everywhere but this has really helped me a lot too this has five different settings and you pick a setting that is right for you when i first started i had to start on level one because I have a temperature that runs about a degree lower than it should. And so I felt like things were just a little bit too hot for me because it is a laser. So, so it's going to get a little bit hot on you and you would need to be a little bit careful about that. Start on a lower setting, bump it up as you need to. But this has just been so good for around the eyes. Now, I still have these deep, deep wrinkles um, and I still have all of that expression lines that are right there, but I do feel like at rest that they're much more diminished. And when I say at rest, it's just like when I'm talking to you and we're you know chatting, I don't feel like they're so bad like they used to be. So I'm loving that. I love that I was able to get it and that I can share it with you and share my experience with you i've really noticed that this fold right here around my nose has been diminished quite a bit and it's not for anywhere except for those heavy wrinkles and like i said i do use it all the way around my mouth i do four different um, passes across like you know in a pattern where you're going up just a little bit and going up just a little bit but yeah whatever's happening with my mouth over the devices i'm using i'm going to keep on it because it's that good and the led light is probably the first one that i would recommend for all of your all around turning over the skin and helping with the wrinkles and the fine lines and then this one this one is really good too i really didn't plan on talking about de devices too much but this is the end of the year this is what i've gotten for this year so we might as well just talk about it this is the microcurrent mini 
it is a microcurrent device and it is meant to help your skin help lift your skin and help get results with your sagging and i got this one particularly because the new face has a very big ball that you run across and then you have to put on a different head in order to go around your eyes and i didn't want to have to buy both of those this is not an inexpensive thing this is quite expensive but i knew that it was going to be an investment for me and i knew that i wanted to do it so i use this all over my neck and then i use it on my jawline i also use it to help carve out some cheekbones here. I use it in between my eyes. I use it to help lift my eyes, my forehead, and I do use it around my mouth. And because these little probes are smaller, I'm really able to get into these little areas that I need to, to help lift them. Now, I didn't buy all of these at once this year. I was sent this one. I was planning on buying it before I won it, but I was sent it. So I didn't buy them all at once. It's kind of been a progression for me, but I will tell you that these are three that I absolutely love having. I want to try out for you guys an LED that is the complete face one. You've seen the masks and then the one that goes down the neck. That's my next purchase coming and to let you guys know whether or not that's worth it. But if you're wanting to get started right away, this isn't that much. It was really quite inexpensive for me and I want to recommend that to you. Okay, last three actual skincare products. I have two moisturizers. The first one is the Glycolic Cream 5% and this one is from Prescript Skin and this is a great moisturizer. I have been in love with the Suko Yaka Suhara for such a long time for being a thick moisturizer. This one is thick as well. Not quite as thick as that one, but the glycolic acid in it, I love that as well because it gives that little bit of turnover and my skin just seems so smooth and so nice when I do use this. A little bit too heavy to go under foundation, but in the morning, I have been using um, this Radiant Soul Beauty this is the brightening moisturizing cream and this one is a little bit thicker as well but it's just light enough to go under my foundation and yet because i am so dry it is thick enough to give me that hydration i need throughout the day i have really been enjoying this i've been loving the glycolic as well but this one is for night and this one is for the day and they're not that expensive i was really surprised oh i forgot to tell you that i did get sent these by i i herb i herb whatever, however you say it but i would recommend these to you anyway because honestly they are both beautiful creams and i'm going to repurchase them absolutely because i love what the glycolic cream does as far as that smoothing and i feel like it does the smoothing because it's exfoliating and then this brightening one. Oh, and by the way this has niacinamide in it shea butter and adenosine adenosine is the heart medication but, but in this particular cream it's being used as a skin aging supplement so it's been used to soften to brighten and to affect the signs of aging with dark spots and all that kind of stuff so i do really like that one a lot lastly um, dermatology this is the tinted moisturizer with an spf of 46 in it this is wonderful this one is light it's moisturizing if you have a tendency to not want to wear foundation this has that tint in it that is so pretty so i definitely want to recommend that and tell you that it's got a great moisturizer in it i feel like the moisturizing agent is fantastic. Now I will say that if you're an oily skin gal again, you might not like this as much because I do feel quite a bit of slip in there, but I use it all the time and I love it. I do two pumps on my face and then I do another pump for my chest and my neck and my ears and the back of my hands, whatever's left over I put on the back of my hands anytime, anyway, anytime. So I wanted to make sure I told you about that. This was a product that I was so glad I found this year. That's it for my 10 finds of 2020 plus three different devices that I feel like has just made such a fantastic difference and I'm so excited about them. So I hope this was helpful to you all. 2020 is almost over and I'm gonna continue to 
continue to bring you the best of and in installments of different things so keep watching are there skincare products that you discovered this year that you are just gaga over i would love to hear that from you let me know that in the in the comment section below make sure you take care of yourselves stay happy stay healthy stay hydrated stay safe out there at the end of this year and i love you very much and i'll catch you in my next video bye friends <laughs>